In the shadowy recesses of internet forums and dusty old books, I stumbled upon a tale so bizarre it had to be explored. Have you ever wondered if time travel, mind control, and secret government experiments could be more than just science fiction? Well, sit tight, because we're diving into the murky waters of the Montauk Project, a conspiracy theory that combines all these elements into one mind-bending narrative. Greetings, curious souls. Today, we're peeling back the layers of one of the most controversial and enigmatic stories out there. The origins of the Montauk Project trace back to the aftermath of World War II and the infamous Philadelphia Experiment, an alleged naval military experiment that supposedly rendered a ship invisible and teleported it across space. According to the legend, the Montauk Project was a continuation of these experiments, relocated to the desolate and eerie Montauk Air Force Station in New York. The goal? To develop advanced techniques in psychological warfare and temporal manipulation. The sheer audacity of these claims beckons us to delve deeper. Time travel the stuff of dreams and nightmares. The Montauk Project allegedly made this fantasy a reality. Witnesses and whistleblowers claim that scientists at Montauk developed the capability to bend time, creating portals to different eras and dimensions. Testimonies from supposed participants describe vivid journeys through these temporal gateways, encountering both future civilizations and ancient worlds. The technology, they say, involved a peculiar chair wired to the brain of the subject, allowing them to navigate the temporal streams with their minds. But it wasn't just about time travel. The Montauk Project is also notorious for its alleged mind control and psychic experiments. Techniques supposedly ranged from remote viewing to psychic spying aiming to harness and weaponize the latent abilities of the human mind. These experiments were said to be conducted with ruthless efficiency, using sophisticated technology to manipulate thoughts, emotions, and even actions. The ethical boundaries were not just blurred but obliterated, creating a chilling narrative of scientific ambition gone awry. One of the most disturbing aspects of the Montauk Project involves the so-called Montauk Boys. Allegedly, young boys were abducted from the streets and subjected to brutal experiments designed to break their will and mold them into psychic warriors. These accounts tell of unimaginable suffering as the boys were exposed to extreme psychological and physical trauma. Their stories, if true, paint a horrifying picture of human experimentation and the lengths to which certain factions might go in the pursuit of power. Preston Nichols, a key figure in unraveling the Montauk Project narrative, brought these tales into the limelight with his book, The Montauk Project, Experiments in Time. Nichols claimed to have recovered repressed memories of his involvement in these experiments. His accounts detail not only the bizarre nature of the experiments, but also the sinister intentions behind them. Whether you view him as a whistleblower or a fabricator, his stories have certainly fueled the fire of conspiracy theorists and curious minds alike. Albielek's testimony takes the story even further. He claimed to have been part of the Philadelphia experiment connecting it directly to the Montauk Project. According to Bielek, he and his brother were teleported from the USS Eldridge in 1943 to the Montauk base in 1983. His vivid recounting of time loops, parallel universes, and the manipulation of reality itself has added an extra layer of complexity and intrigue to the already convoluted saga of the Montauk Project. His tales, whether true or not, 
compel us to ponder the limits of human experimentation and governmental secrecy. Duncan Cameron's involvement introduces the theme of psychic warfare. Cameron, who allegedly worked alongside Nichols, claimed to possess significant psychic abilities enhanced through the Montauk experiments. He recounted using these abilities in a variety of psychic warfare scenarios, including influencing thoughts and actions at a distance. The idea of weaponizing the human mind, of creating psychic soldiers, adds a chilling dimension to the Montauk lore. It begs the question, how far would governments go in their quest for ultimate control? At the heart of these claims is the Montauk Chair, a device purportedly capable of amplifying psychic abilities and manipulating time and space. The chair, they say, was a central piece of technology in the Montauk experiments, enabling subjects to project their consciousness across time and dimensions. This technological marvel, as described by Nichols and others, paints a picture of a dark intersection between advanced science and the ethical void. The mere possibility of such a device existing forces us to confront uncomfortable questions about the boundaries of scientific exploration. Beneath the Montauk Air Force Station lies a labyrinth of underground facilities, or so the stories go. These hidden chambers were allegedly the real heart of the Montauk project, housing the secret laboratories where unspeakable experiments were conducted. The accounts of these subterranean spaces are filled with images of cold, sterile environments, humming with the energy of advanced machinery. They evoke a sense of dread, a feeling that something profoundly unnatural took place far from the prying eyes of the public. It's in these depths that the darkest chapters of the Montauk story were supposedly written. The government's response to these allegations has been predictably dismissive. Officially, the Montauk project is dismissed as pure fiction, a wild conspiracy theory with no basis in reality. Yet the persistent claims of cover-ups and disinformation campaigns suggest otherwise. Some argue that the government's denials are just another layer of deception, a tactic to keep the public from uncovering the truth. This dichotomy between official statements and alleged reality fuels the fire of suspicion and skepticism leaving us to wonder what secrets might truly lie hidden behind those locked doors. The Montauk Project has left an indelible mark on popular culture, influencing countless books, movies, and TV shows. Perhaps most famously, it inspired the Netflix series Stranger Things, which echoes many elements of the Montauk legend, from secret experiments to portals, to other dimensions. This cultural impact underscores the powerful allure of the Montauk story, a blend of mystery, horror, and the unknown that captivates our collective imagination. Whether fact or fiction, the Montauk project has become a modern myth, a story that resonates deeply with our fears and fascinations. Despite its allure, the Montauk Project has faced substantial skepticism and debunking efforts. Critics argue that the stories are too fantastical, too inconsistent to be credible. They point to the lack of concrete evidence, the dubious nature of the sources, and the implausibility of the claims. Skeptics remind us to apply critical thinking and demand verifiable proof before accepting such extraordinary stories. Yet, even in the face of skepticism, the Montauk Project endures, a testament to our willingness to entertain the extraordinary, to believe in the possibility of hidden truths. The legacy of the Montauk Project is one of enduring intrigue and speculation. Decades after the supposed events, 
the story continues to generate discussion and debate. It has become a touchstone for conspiracy theorists and truth seekers, a symbol of the unknown possibilities lurking within our own government and scientific communities. The Montauk Project reminds us of our fascination with the boundaries of science and the potential for unseen forces at play. It challenges us to consider what might be possible, what secrets might still be hidden away waiting to be uncovered. As we conclude this journey through the enigmatic and controversial tale of the Montauk Project, we're left with more questions than answers. Could such experiments have really taken place? What might this mean for our understanding of reality and the powers that govern us? Whether you walk away convinced of the project's reality or remain a staunch skeptic, the Montauk Project forces us to grapple with the limits of our knowledge and the depths of human ambition. Thank you for joining us on this exploration. Stay curious, stay questioning, and until next time, keep seeking the truth.